in a March 13, 2010 article that appeared in the daily item titled City Police Searching for Camera Locations, the public was told the federal grant it received was for 20 wireless surveillance cameras yet in an April 30, 2013 article it was revealed the grant was for over 200 cameras. The March 13, 2010 article also reported that Sunbury's surveillance video will also be on the city's website. But now the mayor says the public might only get a few feet of the park. Independent studies from around the world have concluded that surveillance camera technology does not reduce crime, including a study investigated what effect San Francisco's surveillance system had on violent and other crimes. These studies have concluded that surveillance technology, such as the kind the city of Sunbury will be using, does not reduce crime. These systems waste our tax money and treat us all like criminals. Together, we the people can put an end to this warrantless surveillance by supporting legislation to dismantle the Sunbury surveillance system and restore the Fourth Amendment and support liberty candidates for mayor and city council this November.